Hi, welcome to 10 times. In this particular video, we will be discussing about registration settings, customizing registration form. The organizer is entitled to do custom settings for the event's registration. It may involve personalizing the registration form or enabling disabling the registration buttons on the event listing page. For going on to the registration settings, first you need to log in onto your dashboard of the event. Go on to the left hand side on registration and ticketing and choose the registration settings option. Once on the registration settings option, you would be able to find these multiple options. Scroll down the registration settings page and check the RSVP registration form and you would be able to find some question fields. Some of these questions are mandatory while logging on to 10 times and registering for any of the event, whereas some of these questions are mandatory for floor. If you want to make them mandatory for floor to be answered, you just need to turn on the toggle button and click on the option of save. Onto the company option, you can also choose university and school according to your choice of the event. If we go ahead, you would be able to find the custom field option. Herein, you would be able to enter any of your custom questions that you need to ask your users. You need to set the question. Turn on the toggle button for mandatory if you want the answer to, to be available for your event. And then click on settings if you wish to make any of the settings of enabling, disabling the mandatory option or setting up the access for public and private. Once done, you can click on save. After clicking on save, you would be able to find that the registration custom question is saved. And if you still want to do any of these settings, you can still go back and do the settings. If you scroll up, you would be able to find the form settings option. Here onto the form settings option, you would be able to do any of the settings for stall bookings and visitor registration request. Please remember, while you're setting up your quest custom questions, you have multiple fields like text, select box, multi-select, file upload. If you have a select box, you need to enter the option. Like for example, we have the location as Banaras, then Lucknow. So you need to choose and then click on enter. And after choosing, you can click on save. Also, if you have, if you choose the option of multi-select, you need to enter the option and mark it by commas. The last option available is file upload in which files can be uploaded and you can do the settings for the same. For example, I enter and set up it as a mandatory question and save it. I would be able to do the file upload while answering this question. You can also set up that how many files can be uploaded for the same. I hope this video was helpful for you. Thank you.